Hi, this is Mitch Mitchell, and I'm about to do another food review. Now, I had said that I wasn't going to be turning my channel into one of those that just did reviews, and I'm really sticking by that belief. But you know what? These Oreo people just keep coming out with new stuff. So, last Sunday night, I was watching a review that Lamar Wilson did about these peppermint cream Oreos. So, while I was at the store, it was my intention to buy a pack of those because he really enjoyed them. And I love mint Oreos, so I figured, well, maybe the peppermint cream. And you know what? My store didn't have it. I, he, well, he ended up buying his at Target, and Target is just too darn far. I share a backyard with a major grocery chain, so that's where I went. So instead, they had these key lime pie Oreos with Graham cookie. And I said, well, you know what? I haven't seen anyone do that one. I like key lime. I like Graham. Let me try that. And so I haven't opened this yet so that you can see totally fresh here. And I'm going to go through it with you. Doesn't mean it's going to be a long video because, you know, how long could a cookie video be? And the way I eat them, you know, I just eat the whole thing. So that's the cookie. And you can see it's green in the middle. It smells like key lime pie. Let's try it. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Goodness, that's good. Yes, that is very good. It does taste like the creamy kind of key lime pie, which happens to be the kind I like more than the gelatin type. So this is very good. And the graham cookie, I like a lot. Because I'm not crazy about that vanilla cookie that uh, Oreos has. They used to have that Swiss cookie, which was wonderful. But I've never really been crazy about the vanilla cookie. So it's really dependent upon what's inside it, whether I kind of like it or not. And most of them I really don't like. But this graham cookie with this key lime... This is pretty wonderful stuff. And I don't know about his, but mine has the closed top, so I can actually close them back. So the only gripe I have is that two cookies equals 150 calories, and that's kind of depressing. But because it's a limited edition, there's only 10 servings. So if I was predisposed to do so, and let's hope I'm not, I could eat the whole pack and it ends up being 1,500 calories. I could cover that. But it's my intention to be smarter than to do that. Anyway, I figured a short little review video on a Friday can't hurt anybody. And who knows, maybe this will encourage you to go to the store and get some. So I hope you have a good day. Hope you have a wonderful weekend. See y'all later.